Day two in Basel started with a Duncan run. Oh, angel singing. It's like delicious. Then we took the short walk across the bridge and into the city center, snapping as many shots as we could to remember this gorgeous scenery. We had come back to explore the Christmas market further and enjoy one last meal in the city, but we took our time getting to the market, passing by shops with stuffed llamas and, of course, Jenny's disco outfit. We also ran into some street performers and dogs. This was our first introduction to the European Christmas markets, and we were impressed. Unfortunately, after visiting this one and a few others, we were Christmas marketed out. But still, while in Basel, our excitement was at peak level. So many fun handmade gifts, yummy food, and cute decorations to enjoy. As far as European Christmas markets go, Basel may be our favorite. It was huge and had some of the best decorations in our opinion. After walking through the Christmas market, we decided to return to the super cool fountain and take in another view of the cathedral. Then it was time for lunch. This time we went for one of Anne Marie's recommendations with restaurant Zoom Brown and Moots, AKA the Brown Bear. Jenny ordered an almost $30 burger that was nothing but a disappointment. Sorry, Brown Bear. But Joni, oh, what she ordered did not disappoint. It was a lovely sausage and pretzel appetizer dish but the sausages arrived in juice. She then became the show of the restaurant. So I'm just gonna roll the clip. Did you know your sausages were gonna come in juice? <laughs> Meanwhile, over here is a $27 burger. Oh yeah, baby. Mm. Oh, juice flew everywhere. Where's your mustard? Huh? Where's your mustard? I don't know. Maybe this mustard is red. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Those people are looking at you. <laughs> in there? Yeah. It's literally two sausages. And juice. That's why it was cheaper than the burger, because you didn't get anything. <laughs> People are watching you. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Hello, everyone. We're back. This is mustard. <laughs> Don't pour it on anything. Come on, I'm putting it in a little slime. Okay. You're, you're the show of the restaurant right now. Huh? You're the show of the restaurant right now. Because those people over there are looking at you. They have been since the beginning. Looking at you and laughing. <laughs> That you got a face on right now and it ain't cute. <laughs> no, it's not bad. Okay, well, that's been it for today's segment of Joni B tries weird things. <laughs> that's what's left of my $27 burger. It was so so. Surprise. Joni B did not drink her juice. This is for the money. 
After lunch, it was time to leave the Hyperion and board our ship, the Viking Alruna. The Christmas decorations on board really helped put us all in the spirit. After seeing our room, it was time for a welcome cheese and wine tasting. We're not big wine drinkers, so since we had the silver beverage package, Joni and Jenny ordered their choice of drink. For Joni, a chocolate martini, and for Jenny, a Bellini. And we just sat back and looked at Basel through the ship window. After cocktail hour, it was time for dinner. Viking River ships have one seating for dinner, so everyone gets to eat together. And on this first night, we sat with the people who would soon become like family and enjoyed some pretzel bread, Jenny's fave, the Caesar salad with anchovies, a ribeye for Joni, and a tuna steak with spinach and potatoes for Jenny. For dessert, it was an iced latte, plum tart, and a black forest style dessert. After dinner, we all hung out in the lounge for a while and slept like babies as the Viking Aruna sailed to the next destination. We'll see you next week when you find out where that is. Bye, y'all.